Today's wardrobe challenge, what to wear to go to the gyno. Now, first thing obviously is good undies because we all know that when you go to the gyno or when you get a pap test, cervical screening, whatever they're called, the first thing you do is fold your undies and pop them under your clothes. But you still wanna be wearing nice undies. Unclear why. Second thing you want is easy access. Going to get an examination is not the time for jeans and boots. You want something ideally that you can just whip up Knickers off, a dress. This is my 90s slip dress moment. And I'm being even more 90s by wearing like a singlet underneath it. But if I don't, I'll show you what it looks like without a singlet. I don't hate it, but it's just, it's just a bit much for like doctor, work meetings. No, this just gives me more coverage. So easy to whip up, knickers off, shoes. Controversial, stupid choice logistically, but I want to wear these because they go and I just do. I'll ask my doctor if I can keep my shoes on. Is that bad? Knickers off, shoes on. Why not? Some people have sex with their socks on. Like, is it is it that different? I love a denim shirt as a jacket, a shacket or a jerk. Because it's not as heavy as a jacket. Oh my God, I'm so 90s. Denim jacket over a slip dress. Comfy. Easy access. <laughs>